Valentine's Day gifts from James because he is spoiling me to the max. So as you know, we've been doing the whole place and this is my new wardrobe. Let me turn on the light. <gasps> Look at this, he literally did a whole wardrobe for me. We haven't painted the walls yet, but look how cute this is. He set up all of my shoes in here. I mean, not all of them. They haven't all been unpacked yet, but look, he set up my shoes. And this is what I came home to yesterday for Valentine's Day. And then he like put all of a bunch of stuff I have to unpack for my trip to Florida. Um, with my family, my boots, and then this we're just using for um, clothes storage for now until we move into the main house. This is eventually going to be a bedroom. He moved all of our stuff into here. So, you know, all of our jackets and some summer clothes and everything. And then clothes here. This is so James has a love for swag golf. I don't know if we have any golf fans, but James is obsessed. He does all of their launches. I support him. Um, and he has like a bunch of his swag little golf things. He just went to a really fun PGA tournament and everything. And then all of my clothes in here. So this was such a fun surprise. And then I just came home from Valentine's Day and he was surprising me again. Come on, let's go see Miss Molly. Let's go Miss Molly. Show me the way. Show me daddy. Show me what daddy's doing. So I just came home and I was like kind of unsure what happened because his whole truck is like filled with all this stuff so I was like huh maybe he's like moving and stuff and then I came in and look at this he has been just going ham honey it looks so good he brought stuff from the barn it's my weighted vest this is my haul from Target which I'm gonna open with you guys. Oh my gosh. Honey, this is so good. Okay, I am going to get changed in my wardrobe from my Valentine's Day outfit into something comfy and go help James and everything downstairs. How amazing is this? Literally makes me so happy. So happy. I finally have clothes again. Mind you, I packed up my clothes in September, like first week of September, and it is now February 15th. So September, October, November, December, January, like almost six months of not having a wardrobe. I've been semi-living out of like, like mini amount of clothes, like a suitcase full of clothes. And like, I've had clothes in my mom's house, my dad's house, the barn, James's house. So four different locations, plus now here. So like, I've had to like scavenger. Like when I was packing for Florida, I literally had to like go to four different houses to try to find my summer clothes. It was not so much fun. So, yeah, that was, he's like cleaning up downstairs. So, I'm so happy to have all of my clothes in one spot. I am so happy. So, I'm going to get some comfy clothes on since these are not my, you know, construction clothes, sadly. I mean, it would be nice to look this cute for construction. But, practically speaking, I'm going to get some comfy clothes on and get started. I am changed into my comfy clothes and I am repping Flourish. I'll link the tea that we have for Flourish in the description box if you guys want to order one. It is so cute and comfy. So I'm going to get started with James and bring you along for the ride.
<laughs> Such a surprise. Come home to, honey. I'm so excited. So this is the first floor of the mill. Obviously, we will, you know, do some more decorating, but for now, it's nice to just have a spot to, like, bring some things out of storage. This will be, like, a nice little relaxing area. We have a wet sink over there. That's the kitchen. Um, this is really, really cool. This comes down. What's so, a wet sink? A wet sink? Oh, as opposed to a dry sink. <laughs> yeah. This is the kitchen currently. Wet bar. That's what it is. This is the kitchen currently, so needs some love and work. We don't want to talk about him. Um, but this is so cool. So this is like all of the um, haul that I got from Target that I'll show you guys. And this is so cool. It comes down. So we were thinking of possibly putting a TV down there and then have a piece of artwork, probably like a sketch of the farm with trails and everything on top of it, which would be really cool. All of these will come down. This beautiful statement piece is gonna be so cool. Have like little maybe like flowers coming off of it and stuff. And then we're gonna have bookshelves everywhere. Right, honey? Bookshelves of books and whiskey. And what, what was your other idea? Oh, painting, painting stuff and everything going to kind of be like a library rec room. Give him kisses, Em. Give him kisses. bear Chop it up, bunny. Where's your axe? Okay, now prepare. Oh, oh, it's getting floppy. You got some coming down the side. <laughs> Is it good? <laughs> it's pure with cream. So far, so good. Yeah? You got some coming down the side? Yeah. I think mine needs a little bit of dressing. Whoa. <laughs> oh yeah, that's much better. Good. 